Hello, my name is Robin Abrams. I am a dental hygienist of 26 years, and I am also the dental hygiene recruiter here at North American Dental Group. I also teach very part-time as an adjunct faculty member for semester three dental hygiene students at the Technical College here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I am here today to talk about oral cancer screenings during Oral Cancer Awareness Month in April. A few months ago, the whole head and neck exam turned very personal for me. I was diagnosed with skin cancer on my forehead and I had it removed a few weeks ago. So you can see that there is a nice scar that is healing on my forehead. And so I have made it my personal journey to reach out to my peers and ask them to conduct head and neck exams on every patient, every time. And I encourage you to do some research and really look at what oral cancer and skin cancer looks like and educate yourself so that you're able to educate your patients. I have always in my clinical practice been very adamant about conducting my head and neck exams and I truly thought that I knew what I was looking at until it appeared on my face and I didn't know. Now I have educated myself and I am even more adamant with the students that I teach in telling them that this is a very important exam that you could be saving someone's life. And that's the reality. It's very important for me to get the word out there so that you can catch any suspicious areas early and hopefully prevent any invasive treatment for the patient and to bridge the gap between the medical and the dental profession so that we can refer patients early and hopefully prevent any cancer from spreading. So I hope I've inspired you today to change your clinical practice even just a little bit and conduct your oral cancer screening, the intra and extra oral exam, every single patient, every single visit. Thank you.